welcome. This is Melissa Arma with the Stock Swish and a review in Mew. Mew is a watch because it has earnings out tonight. It probably will gap. Where will it gap? It will either gap up or gap down. I don't know. I don't do trades into the earnings. I shouldn't say I never do. I've done it before once in a blue moon, I will, when I feel 100% conviction that something will go in the direction of the earnings and the gap, but you really never know until it does. So the method that I do, the, the rating the gap, the 26 points, looking at that price section is all after, after the gap has occurred. The gap happens in the post-market, like it will in Mew, and the pre-market, which will be tomorrow morning. So then I rate it. I can rate stuff at night, but I usually wait to the morning. So I'll wait for the gap, see the gap happen, rate it. If it rates per my system 20 points or more, if it gaps down, I will short it. If it wait, rates per my system 20 points or more, if it gaps up and is a bullish gap, then I will go long it. I don't know, again, what Mew does. Mew is a stock that will typically, though, will go with the market. You saw Mew gap up today with the market, and it rallied. Now, this is losing steam here into 2 o'clock. And the market really is not. So that's interesting, but... Here, let's look at the chart of the Mew. Ran up today to 80, got over it by eight cents. And this is a very, 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 very bullish chart. Look at this. It's almost gone straight up. Multiple gaps, rallies, all into the end of 2020, into the beginning of 2021, and it's just, it's just had a tremendous move. In fact, this stock has doubled its move. If you look at it from November of 2019, the stock has doubled. I mean, it was in the 40s and it ran up to 80. So that's a that's a beautiful move. I think this is a significant earnings for this because if it drops off and sells off, uh, that would not be good after that type of move. Um, but it's hard to believe that anything that this would do would really change the overall trend of Mew because it is so, so strong and it had such a such a huge move um, and, and, and very, very quickly. So I'll be watching Mew tonight. I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. But again, when I'm making decisions and what you come and learn from me, if you want to learn is I read the price, I rate the gap, I rate the price action of the gap, I do it on the daily chart. And that is how I determine the direction I'm going to do the trade, whether I'm going to go long or short. So I'll watch me tonight after hours. It definitely moves and this definitely has volume and we're probably going to play it. Be nice to have a solid earnings trade to end the week on a Friday. Earnings season starts next week. It's a great time to trade active and I can't wait for next week to start the banks report next week. If you'd like more information, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Have a great day, everyone.